Four years ago, Arcadia University kickstarted their men's volleyball program. At the time, Eli Poor was pulling double duty as head coach for both the men's and women's teams. Since those humble beginnings, the Knights have blossomed into a national power and made their first NCAA tournament last season. A large part of the squad's success comes from the inaugural freshman class, which includes a Bernie native who's had his fingerprints all over the team's culture. Andrew Jafrida, middle opposite, Bernie, Texas, champion high school. Who doesn't want to start a first year program? I mean, it's literally like writing your own storybook. I get to have a say in the culture on campus and what we want this program moving forward to look like in the years to come. It didn't take long for Angelo Jafrida to make his presence felt on campus at Arcadia. He came in right away and like met these strength coaches and was like, listen, I'm going to be the hardest working person in this athletic department. I'm just letting you know right now I may be a freshman, but I will be I will be the example. I just wanted to establish uh, like a, a hard work ethic for the team. You know, I mean, I'm not the big guy. You know, I mean, we have six foot six and above players. We have a first team All-American on our team, but we got some ballers on this team. And um, where I fit in, in my role was in the weight room. You know, I was a leader there, I was a leader on the court, um, and kind of got the guys rowdy on the bench there. Every year he played a different role for us as a volleyball player, and he just would adapt and get good at it. He's all about the daily grind. That is what he lives for. Every day since that freshman campaign began, Arcadia has been building towards a goal set by Poor in 2017, win the national championship senior year. After claiming their first middle athletic conference title as juniors last year, the Knights were still on pace to accomplish that. Until the coronavirus pandemic canceled the rest of their collegiate careers while they were on spring break. We got the call from Eli and he said season's canceled boys, so don't come back to campus. When we finished our out of conference play, we were sitting exactly where we wanted to be. You know, I mean, win the conference and you go to the tournament. That was always our vision um, and to be ranked and to have all the national recognition that we did, it was nice. It's a shame that we didn't get to finish out the season, but uh, I was there out in the court when we did. So it was just a pleasure to play. Jafrida is currently waiting out the pandemic in Baltimore. Now here's a look at the legacy he's leaving behind. He completed Arcadia's Iron Knight Challenge three times as a two-time male strength and conditioning athlete of the year, and he won the 2020 NSCA All-American Athlete Award, a fitting recognition for a remarkable career.